Right, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to link proxy for you with IX Browser. Now, IX Browser is one of the top, if not the best choice for protecting your accounts online. Now, IX Browser is forever free anti-detect browser. Now, what I'm also going to be showing you is how you can sync your profiles in IX Browser to make everything seamlessly so much easier. But don't forget, I'm gonna be showing you proxy for you and how you can connect their proxy server with IX Browser to make you the undetectable god of the internet. Right up first, this is IX Browser. Like I said in the intro, forever free anti-detect browser. All you have to do is head on up and click on that download button. And let me just show you what exactly you'll get. You'll get custom fingerprints, you'll get the data storage, team management, support for browser extension, that's on Chrome, cookies management and batch operations. Their one-stop solution for all your needs, whether it's multi-accounts for SMM, e-commerce and drop shipping, or even traffic arbitrage. Why is it free and safe? IX Browser helps users to isolate accounts through the fingerprint method and IP method. If you want to know more, they do break it all down for you in here and the pricing is at the bottom. But once you are set to go, simply click on download and it will redirect you over to this. Obviously, I'm, I'm logged in to my account. And what we can see here is there's multiple different profiles. I've got a proxy server on here, of course, proxy for you. I'm going to be showing you exactly how to link that very shortly. But if you want to connect, say, for example, you want this one, this one, this one, and this one all to be synced. So it means you've got four browsers open. Whatever you do on one browser, it does on all four of them. Nice and easy. You, you click on this arrow here. Right, today's sponsor is Lead Sniper. That's lead-sniper.com. Link will be down below. Your unfair advantage in lead generation. Now, it automatically scrapes leads from Google Maps, Yellow Pages, and domain-based emails in just a few clicks. Now, no more manual digging. You get verified emails, phone numbers, and business data fast. Now, with lifetime access options, it's efficient, affordable, and insanely powerful. Now, check out that link down below, and let's jump back into the video. Click on that and then click on open and start sync. Now, once you've done this, this section will come up on the right. So once you're in your dashboard, you want to create some profiles. Okay, so what we're going to do is click on create profile. And then just for the making of this video, uh, we're just going to select a couple of random ones. These are the only ones you need to do. Let's go Facebook one. Next step. At the moment, we're going to put no proxy. Right now, once you've created your profile, the next step is proxy configuration. Now, this is where we head on over to proxy for you. And I'm in my dashboard of proxy for you. You guys all know about proxy for you. Link is in the description for you to do your own due diligence. But it's the best proxy service, affordable, probably the cheapest around as well. That gives you everything that they offer for you. You can see I've got 0.99 gigabyte left. And as we go down, this is your residential proxy. Once once you're in here this is your generic access this is if you were to go in like your native country for me it's united kingdom however if we want to be for example in a different country we want to be masked to be in russia for example maybe not the smartest choice but we're going to go with it if you want to go into russia what we then want to do is head on down to sticky sticky means that our ip address will be changed every for example this is 25 minutes but if we go for 15 so every 15 minutes, it changes. So it will change the where the position we are in Russia. Okay, now all you have to do, you don't have to click any save configuration, nothing like that. Scroll to the bottom. And then these are the proxy system, username, password, everything that you'll need. There is a little hint on the side, proxy format. First bit is login, then password, host name, then port. So if we head on back to IX browser, and we just make this a little bit shorter so we can see exactly what we are doing. What you want to do is click on HTTP, okay? So pro proxy detection global line. First, it's asking for the proxy host. So the proxy host is your proxy.proxy4u.com up until the semicolon. You want to copy that, head back over and paste that into there. Okay, now the next bit, make sure you're sticking to the same line. So this is 10,000 for the port number. And then a proxy account, which is the username. The username is the very first section up until the colon again. You can probably guess the little pattern here. So you go up to the colon, ignore the colon for the next bit, and then the password will be after the colon up until the at symbol. Okay, now once you've done that, you want to click in the password. You've done everything for there. 
Okay, then what you want to do is click on create. So that's now doing the, the proxy for us. And if we were to go back, we will see it at the very top. Let me just make this a little bit bigger for you so you guys understand. So this is the one we've just done. Okay, so this is HTTP pattern. This is proxy for you 10,000 and that's the profile name one okay so if i favorite this so we can just make sure it doesn't get mistaken what we want to do is then go in and create a, another one okay so we're just going to pick amazon this time call it two and then we're going to put it in default groups start we're not going to put a proxy on for this one i've showed you how to do that proxy service and then go back and then we will star this one as well just so that i can show you exactly what we need to do with this sync feature now if you highlight both you want to click on open in batches and then open and start sync right now once we've got both of those groups activated what we want to do is just get that proxy on this one as well there is a quicker way of doing it so once you've done your account you click on the proxy and then click on custom proxy and then proxy referencing existing profile and we want to go for this one that we've just created in russia okay so once we click once we click confirm everything will be inputted for you you press confirm again and it will change over to this one where it's in the exact one we are looking for now what you want to do to get that sync feature that i was telling you about and gives you that ability to have control of both of the the browsers at once all you have to do is click on that arrow open and start sync and then it will come up with this start syncing and then this is where you'll see the browsers coming up Okay, so this one is, you can see here, Russia. We're actually in Moscow at the moment. That's because of our proxy service has sent us all the way over to there. Now this one, we obviously clicked for Amazon. And as you can see in the top corner, we have headed on over to Amazon. And over on here, they are redirecting us to Facebook. And as you can see, this little bar is coming up here, synchronizing Opera. Okay, so once it's there, if you want to stop that sync, all you have to do is click on that big red button, stop sync. Okay, now that we've stopped the sync, we can close those off and these come up here cloud backup in progress, cloud backup in progress, profile closed, profile closed. But there you have it, guys. Like I said in the intro, nice and easy, nice and quick. And that is how you can stay anonymous and do multiple things. So if you're an SMM or if you're into arbitrage or anything along those lines and you need, instead of having multiple monitors, you can have multiple screens on one monitor. Or if you have multiple monitors, have multiple screens on multiple monitors. But um, that is honestly how easy it is. And having that proxy service, which sent me over to Russia. I'm in the United Kingdom in London. So my computer is pretending to be over in Moscow. So it just shows the protection. If someone's trying to get into your system, they're looking in the completely wrong country. But thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, press that bell to be notified of my next video. But for now, peace.